Hello everybody and welcome back to the shop. Ten more minutes, Thunder Chief building action. You know what people? We're about out of these ten minute videos. This Thunder Chief is almost finished. Almost. I got the wings completely done. They're both done and bam, there's one, there's the other one over there. Uh, I'm fixing the bolts them on with the duct all in place and uh, then all I got to do is some mixing on my radio I got to make a couple extension cords just some tinkering Thunder Chief's going to be finished said CG don't want to forget that someone asked me what mixing was in my radio okay well my nose gear steering and my rudder for instance I got them on two different channels and the reason they're on two different channels so I can dial in my nose gear on a knob and get it going straight without affecting the trim on my rudder you see what I mean so I gotta mix them two channels and also my brakes I hook my brakes up to the down elevator so when I push down elevator my brakes come on so I mix them two channels and uh, just setting throws and uh, stuff like that. But we'll go over all that. And uh, hey, got an update. Got dad update. Dad is doing fantastic. They woke him up at midnight last night and put him in a regular room. He's out of intensive care. And he's going to be there about a week. Then he's going to be home. Okay. Now, I asked that desk if anyone has sent a card or anything to that first room he was in. Uh, he will still get it, so don't worry about that. But this is where Dad's at. Go ahead and hit pause and go get your pencil. Wesley Medical Center, 550 North Hillside, Building 4, Room 302, Wichita, Kansas, 67214. That is Dad's room where Dad is at recovering. And he's doing great. Uh, I talked to Sandy this morning, and uh, she thinks he's going to be tired because uh, after they moved him to his room at midnight, he said he didn't get back to sleep till about three, and because they was poking around on him and stuff and hooking him up to them new machines, and then they woke him up for at six to go take X-rays. Uh, they wanted to see how everything was doing and everything's great. And uh, so we can expect a speedy recovery from old dad. Yeah, it's in shape. So, I'm going to put my wings on today and we're going to get this tongue chief finished up. But, golly, I know some of you are saying, oh, that tongue chief will never get done. I put chairs away. I put another piece of wood on the other side of that spar. Right down, I'll show you. Alright. There. There was an opening right here. I cut that piece of wood. I used a pattern for this. And the, the piece that I cut, you know, that first duck I cut right there, I measured up there. I uh, 
put this board on top of that one and kind of drew out these lines and then just measured up where that arc was and bam fit perfect on both wings kind of shocked but that'll keep that spar in place keep it from moving forward and backward keep it from twisting any kind of spar like this what you got to do if, if as long as that dude's standing up that dude ain't going to move but if it lays down it's over so you gotta you gotta keep that thing standing up i've been meaning to do that for a while now i just haven't got around to it okay back to the thunder chief Look it back up but uh i'll make some videos today Grab my tightening wrench. It ain't bad either way you're going on. Got to hook up the wires. talking they think I got someone out here they think dad's here or something <laughs> I just had to hook up the hose in the wing. 